To create a new user, first log in to online banking or the mobile app. Click the Business Tools drop-down menu in the top navigation bar and select Business Admin. Next, click the Users tab. Your existing users are listed here. To add a new user, click the red plus button in the top right. A sidebar will appear to the right. Here, you can choose to create a new user with a new set of permissions, or you can create a new user with the same permissions as an existing user. Let's create a user with a new set of permissions. Select New User and click Next. Enter the first name, last name, and valid email address for the new user. Then, create a new username. A temporary password will be sent to the email address you entered. For added security, you will need to send the user their username so they can log in. When you are finished, click Next. Now it's time to select the permissions you would like to apply. If you would like this user to have payment permissions, you can also adjust their access levels in the Payment Types section. You can set limits for this user as long as they do not exceed the overall company limits. You can also require this user to receive approvals or allow them to authorize submissions from other users. When you are finished, click Next. Then click Select Accounts. We will now select which shares the user will have access to. Click the checkbox next to the share you would like to select, then click Select Accounts. The following page will confirm your selection. Click Next. On this page, we will choose permissions for the accounts you previously selected. Simply click the toggle icon to the right to turn on a permission. Click Next. The last page is a complete summary of the permissions you have selected for the new user. If everything looks correct, click Submit. You can review the user's permissions again by clicking View Details. Your new user will now appear in the user list. If you would like to create a new user who has the same permissions as an existing user, click the red plus button in the top right. Select Copy a User, and then choose the existing user you would like to replicate. Another option is to click the three dots to the right of the existing user you would like to replicate and select Create Similar User. The same sidebar will appear with the existing user's name already populated for you. You can choose to copy permissions and limits, account access, or both. Then click Next. The rest of the process will be the same as creating a new user.